guys, it is me, Life Simmer, and welcome to part 22 of Let's Play The Sims 4. Let's go ahead and jump right back into the Monette house. Alrighty guys, and welcome back to some more Sims 4 gameplay. So currently, if you guys remember, we were at the park, just kind of chilling and, you know, relaxing here and working on our chess uh, aspiration for Jose. And we actually didn't get to do it. <laughs> um, oh wait, that's for his job. Hello, what am I talking about? Not his aspiration, his job, which we've only won one chess game, which is unfortunate. But we are going to go ahead and head home. Um, it is a Saturday evening, so I'm thinking we might head out today. I'm not quite sure, or not today, but tonight. Have an adult's night, uh, even though Candace is pretty pregnant. Why not head out? Or maybe we'll do a family night, even though I don't know what a family night would be at the bar at the blue velvet i don't know we will Alrighty. see guys and here we are now home and we have so many grilled cheese sandwiches uh that we actually need to put away not put in your inventory but go ahead and put those suckers away because there <laughs> are so so many that we need to go ahead and clean up the house is pretty dirty and candace is actually at work right now so hopefully she will be on her way home soon she's actually only three more hours until she's in her third trimester which oh my gosh she's getting huge i have people on twitter telling me that i think it's gonna be twins and i'm like hopefully not <laughs> maybe hopefully i don't know i don't know what i want but I, I actually heard that twins in this game are quite common actually which you know um i don't know if that's a good or a bad thing because you know getting twins should be a very you know, odd thing. Should only get it every so often. Uh, but I heard it's actually quite common, so we will have to see. I'm, I'm a little curious. I, I know triplets are a little bit more rare, but I've definitely heard of a lot of twins coming out. And I mean, Candace is pretty huge, but I don't know if that would depict the size of her stomach and change it. I'm, I'm really not sure. But he's gonna go out and have himself some Fruit Loops. <laughs> my favorite i think we're gonna just have a family night with candace being so big it's really not our place you know just not right now do you feel what i'm saying especially since drake is home alone <laughs> let's let's not leave him alone oh my gosh since drake is home alone let's not leave him home wait wait what was that what i said i don't even know i really don't but we're gonna have him actually come over here and make a health potion oh that sounds pretty freaking cool look at my little badass kid i love him but yeah we're gonna go ahead and make a health potion i don't even know what that would do i'm i'm guessing it would make him feel pretty good i really don't know but uh, we're gonna go ahead and do that and jose is you know gonna clean up a little bit and all of that jazz because it is pretty important to get the house nice and clean before the baby or babies come babies let's go ahead and turn on that light right there we'll turn on this light just kind of get the house a little lit and uh Jose what do you need to do you're not gonna go to sleep quite yet not quite yet and I know I haven't shown this off yet I don't know why I haven't I just you know uh pretty much when you want your sims to I guess work on that motive you just kind of click on it just like that and they will go and do their things so I think that's really awesome for those who are you know kind of like me and lazy can just kind of click and they will do it but uh, okay so if right here in the notification center it said little drake made the most amazing health potion this one will certainly starve off hunger okay so when he's hungry we can have him go ahead and drink that health potion which is pretty cool we're gonna have him experiment a little bit and jose actually come out here and repair that Instead of going to bed, can, oh, electrocution is a thing now. Oh, we gotta be careful because your sims can die from that. Um, so hopefully he doesn't die. <laughs> that would be horrible. But I don't think he will. Let's just hope he doesn't. If he does, I blame EA for making electrocution now a new death. Not, not me. <laughs> but yeah, um, okay, he went ahead and did that. And I guess I'll let him go to sleep. Or actually, he needs to use the potty. And then he will go grab himself a serving and then head to bed. But uh, Drake is in a pretty good mood. And it's a Saturday. He's a little kid. I'm going to let him do his thing here with his potions. And what skill should he actually work on? I'm thinking he might work on his creativity in a little bit. I'm not sure. I don't want him to wake up super late either. All right. And Candace is now home. And I'm pretty sure she is on her third trimester. Yes, she is. Holy what the hell is in this woman what is in her 
What is it? Honestly, it looks like it looks like E.T. is in there making his way out. She's huge. Let's have her come over here in the light. She is so big. Oh, okay. Well, that really didn't help whatsoever. But holy crap, guys. Candace is freaking huge. So, honestly, nobody's quite sure when she's about to have this baby. Uh, this baby, we or babies, I really don't know. We are going to go to the hospital and have them because we had Drake here at home. So, yeah, I can't believe how big she is. Oh, my gosh. She's huge. Um, but she's rather tired, and she did good at work today. So, she's going to go ahead and head to bed. But, oh, my gosh. I can't get over how big she is. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. That belly is effing huge. I can't get over that belly. <laughs> but yeah, I'm going to have everybody head to bed now, including Drake, because it is a little late. So I will see you all in the morning. Alrighty, guys. And it is now morning time. And one thing I really want you guys to notice, um, I don't know if you guys have, but Candace has been using the bathroom a lot, which most pregnant ladies do use the restroom quite a lot, which I mean, hello, there is a baby in their uterus. I, I would not blame them. <laughs> um, but yeah, um, I, I love that, that EA kind of made it pretty realistic with the whole pregnancy aspect. So I would say I'm a pretty big fan. Uh, but she's going to go use the toilet. She's going to come here and actually cook a gourmet meal for breakfast. We are going to make a SimCity cheesecake. Ooh, that sounds really good. And somebody also wanted me to show off the BLT cooking, which I will do. We'll probably make it for lunch or something. Because, uh, you yeah, know, I'm a little curious too. Will she fry bacon? That's what I want to know. And Jose is making some drinks this morning. Look at our garden. It honestly just went to shit. Like, I don't even care right now. I don't even care. A Drake, buddy. How about you? Actually, what does he need to do for his aspiration? Uh, reach level 5 with motor skill. Play video games for 10 total hours. Holy crap. Alright, he's actually going to go play some Sims Forever for a while, hopefully. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and... Go ahead and cook this up. Awesome. Put that in there. And uh, cheesecake is, I would say, probably my favorite cake. I don't know why. I just, there's something about it. Kind of looks like flan, but um, true. And I don't know if BLTs are, yes, here they are. They are a normal cooking skill dish so we will go ahead and make a single serving size uh you know just to go ahead and make it so here it is she is working with some lettuce and bread kind kind of good just did that but i can't speak cutting it up and doing all of that jazz stuff and oh my gosh those titties though they're huge holy crap all right here we are with some tomatoes the tea and blt Look at her and her knives. All right, I guess that's it. <laughs> you don't even fry bacon up. You just magically get bacon. Uh -huh. She's like, that's right, Instagram this because chef. <laughs> uh, plant something 10 times is what he wants to do. We, I don't, I don't want to plant though, but I want him to work on his aspiration. I don't know, but we're actually going to dig some stuff up hopefully we will get look at eliza over here just doing push-ups hopefully we will get some um time capsules so we can continue our little collection over there of our mice and trophies let's see oh we didn't get a time capsule i'm quite sad but i just want candace to give birth already <laughs> and i definitely want to throw a dinner party that would be a lot of fun Oh, and she wants to cook 10 meals while feeling inspired. We might just have to do that. She's feeling inspired right now. It's quite easy to actually feel inspired. But we will have her, I guess, go cook some more gourmet meals. She will make, uh, hmm. Because I want her to work on her gourmet cooking skill. We will have her go make some, oh, I don't know. I guess some cocktail. I don't know. I love cocktail. 
<laughs> so we'll have her go ahead and do oh and she has to pee again as you guys can see that goes down really really fast so i'm actually gonna have her go use the toilet before she continues to cook and jose's uh oh no jose let your pregnant wife go first and i don't know why he's been looking so bulky i'm gonna have to fix that but he's going to invite over who should i invite over i guess we'll invite over bella and maybe we will invite over let's see nadine even though we're kind of going to be gaming all day and maybe larry oh he can't come over oh all right maybe we haven't hung out with this kid braylon so oh he can't come over either i guess alexis is the one coming over along with nadine actually you know what screw that we'll just invite over nadine <laughs> nadine caliente will be right over okay cool It'll be Nadine time. And here is Bella. So Jose is going to come over here and uh, invite her in. And here's Nadine looking so freaking cute. We will go ahead and uh, goof off with her and make fun of adults. Oh, and it looks like Jose is about to piss himself. Um, ask her for typing tips and uh, enthuse about candy. Be super cute. And talk about toys and just do all of that fun stuff. Oh, it sounded like you said nay, like Nadine. She's so cute. Are they not the cutest little things ever? <laughs> Look at them. All right, Jose, do you still have to pee? Yes. Go use the toilet after, after she is done. Oh, she's about to piss herself, actually. Let's go ahead and watch this. Oh, I like how she has the pot in her hand. Oh, how cute, guys. Look at Candace watching. She clearly wiped her ass with that pot. Oh, what a cutie. I actually think I need to reset her really quickly. Um, because she is clearly glitching out with her bladder failure and carrying this pot around like it is her soul. So, let's go ahead and reset her. Okay, so I totally thought I was recording, and I totally wasn't. Uh, but <laughs> Drake has reached a level 6 of the social skill, which is pretty cool. And he can now, um, I'm pretty sure, let's see if we can do this interaction on in here. Uh, I think he can perk people up with a giant teddy bear. I don't know where that would be, or if we would have to purchase one. I don't know, but or maybe somebody has to be sad for us to do it. That would make more sense. But they're so cute. Eliza, go home. Eliza, go home. She's like, girl, I heard you're pregnant again. Let me in. Look at these two. And she still, ha I reset her and she still is carrying around that pot. I don't understand why, but uh, we're going to let her, I guess, carry it around if that's what she wants to do. She can do it all she wants. Um, but yeah, I was going to let Eliza in, but we already have Bella over and we really need to socialize with her. So we're going to invite her to feel the baby. Because we are super pregnant. Bella's probably like, sure, I guess. She, look at her holding the, look at her holding the cocktail, the shrimp. <laughs> I love it. That's amazing. She's like rubbing, rubbing the shrimp all over her. Disgusting. Look at these two. Let me see, is there anything that they could... I think I'm going to get him a dollhouse. <laughs> um, just to, you know, kind of chill. I want them to have something that they can do together, which I know they can play dollhouse together. And I'm not about to pay 15000 I mean, $1,500 for that. That's insane. I will pay, however, that much for a dollhouse, 260 And we'll get a black one and I just want to show you guys how freaking big dollhouses are here in The Sims 4. They are huge which I do like. I think it's uh, different. So we are going to come over here and play dolls with Nadine and Jose is going to play with Bella Goth here at his chess table so he can get that done. Look at these two cuties playing dolls. I love it. 
Look at the dolls. They have like glasses and a ponytail on. They kind of just rattled them around a little bit. What are these two going to do? Come on, go play dolls, but they're so cute. I'm going to let them go do their thing. These two are going to go do this, and I guess... What is Candace doing, actually? She's feeling inspired, so I am going to have her go ahead and continue making some gourmet meals. Uh, just to get that going. How close is she actually to leveling up? And look at Nadine bringing the trash in. Throwing it away. So cute. She is... A level five, almost six, so we are getting pretty close, and she's still carrying that pot. I wish she would get rid of it. Look at the kids being adorable and super good. I love them. And I guess he will go ahead and continue, I guess, drawing a little bit. Dollhouse fun. Making up stories for little people is always a good time. Actually, he's going to come over here and continue playing Sims Forever. Just so we can get that up. Let's see. We've played it for two hours. We need to play it for eight more for us to continue our aspiration. And Jose, please tell me you're going to win because we need this for our job. You have work in 18 hours. Look at Nadine waiting at the dollhouse for him to come play. Aww. <laughs> I wish you'd come over and talk to him. You know what? He's going to come over here and play dolls with her again. Oh, we can name the dolls. Ooh, name the doll family. We're going to name them the... Who? The... The... What family? The Fendersons. Why not? Okay. So, did you win? You did! Awesome! So now he is ready to go get a promotion at work, which of course will help out with the baby and all of that. Just Smolian-wise, we always need extra Smolian, so that is great. He's gonna go ahead and go shower. Oh, and we have now reached level 6 of the gourmet cooking skill, and I think she's actually off to work. Yep. Uh, I should really get going now. Thanks for hanging out with me. See you later. Oh, we can now prepare a rack of lamb. Oh, that sounds really good. <laughs> um, but yeah, she's off to work. And I don't know if she will come home early because she is definitely going to be having a baby rather shortly. Uh, but, you know, she's off. She's really uncomfortable at work. Uh, she's feeling pretty dirty. But I'll probably have her head home in like an hour or two. Just get some hours in. But, um... Yeah, Drake, you can actually... Are you hungry right now? He is. So he's going to go eat some grilled cheese, or actually, he's going to eat some cheesecake, which... Mwah, mwah, mwah. <laughs> Sounds so good. And then he's going to go play some more video games for his aspiration. And Jose's just doing his thing out here. Just doing his thing. All right. And I don't think we get mail on Sundays. I could be wrong. Oops, sorry about that. Um, I'm pretty sure we don't get mail on Sundays. Yeah. Eliza, go home. Oh, my gosh. She really does just love being at our house, I'm guessing. Oh, and let's actually... I showed this to you guys already. I just think it's really freaking awesome. The whole galaxy light thing that we got from work. I don't know. I really like it. What time does he have work tomorrow again? 8 a.m. So... Yeah, he's going to be having a baby, and he has work the next morning. Well, he's not going to be having the baby. Candace will be. And I think um, what I'm going to do is I will probably remodel the whole entire house and uh, just kind of give them a good makeover, as we have been doing really good with promotions. We have about 6,000 extra simoleons. Uh So I think that will be good for everybody. And... I'm going to have a Candace stay home for a little bit longer. Oh, make him... What is all this? Candace is catering a huge party for a prominent client. Everything's going swimmingly until Candace realizes that the centerpieces haven't arrived. She can improvise with something or go without and hope nobody notices. Of course, we're going to make some more... Uh, oh, we actually... Okay, I thought making some centerpieces would actually improve, but... A Apparently it doesn't and we had a small performance loss, which is unfortunate, but I guess so. Whatever. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and just clean up a little bit. Um, nothing too special is happening in this part because I am waiting for the babies. Or the baby. I don't know yet. I'm just, I keep saying babies because I'm thinking twins, but we'll probably just have one baby. And we're going to make some healthy green tea. 
just to kind of boost our mood a little bit. Let's go ahead and uh, the pot is brewing. There we go. And I am going, oh, create fancier dishes, increase gourmet cooking skill, lowers work performance. Hmm. Increases work performance, chance for embarrassed moodlet, schmooze with the boss, no. Uh, lowers work performance, increases social need. Take it easy, work hard. I think for now she's good. Uh, we can kind of work on the gourmet cooking skill here at home, so I guess her just working normally is fine. Um, but yeah, nothing too crazy happening right now. And look, here's the cake. That would be a really nice wedding cake, in all honesty. I really like that, but we're going to go ahead and put it away. We have so many leftovers. Let me open this up. Do you guys see this? So many. Oh, and who's calling? Oh. Oh, it's Drake's phone. Who the... Who's... Oh, it's Nadine. Yes, we're going to go ahead and talk to Nadine. He's probably like, what's up, girlfriend? What's going good? Oh, my gosh. I love them. <laughs> Um, but I, I just saw something I was going to do. Uh, I wanted him to drink his health potion, but he's actually really full right now. So he's just going to talk to Nadine for a little bit. And then go use the toilet and probably take a nap. And we're going to go ahead and clean out the... Oh, he's gaming. Never mind. How close are we actually? We've gamed for five hours total now. Which is good. And yeah, I'm going to go ahead and have uh, Candace leave work early now uh, because she's feeling very uncomfortable. I wouldn't blame her. She's super pregnant. She's tired. So I'm going to have her go sleep for a little while. And um, Drake is in, in bed already too. And Jose is dancing. As usual. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and skip until the baby... Alrighty, guys, and it is time. Uh, Candace is going into labor. It is currently 11.06 p.m. So, like I said, we're going to go ahead and have the baby at the hospital this time around. I'm going to have Jose wake up. He's going to go have the baby at the hospital with her. So, here she is about to burst, taking the shrimp cocktail with her. She looks miserable. Pregnant in labor. It's go time. She's definitely huge. Candace is having a baby. And Jose's off as well. And Drake's home waiting, drinking some OJ. Just like, ah, I'm going to have a little baby brother or sister. Okay. So Candace just gave birth to another baby boy. Um, another boy. <laughs> um, somebody actually told me, they were like, I think it's, you keep having boys because you keep eating apple pie, which we didn't really eat too much apple pie this pregnancy. So I don't know if that's true, but another boy, geez, Louise, we have had a lot of boys. Well, we've only had one boy, but still, this is our second one. Hoy. I'm kind of tempted to name this one Josh. Um, <laughs> Judge me all you want, but now we're gonna have Drake and Josh. Okay, okay So I'm guessing the baby's already in the house. Yep, here's Josh Another baby wearing another little monkey outfit, which is super adorable and we're gonna go ahead and move the bassinet to right here for now um, But yeah, we're actually gonna have Drake come coo at his little brother Gonna go put his OJ down and go coo at him. <laughs> oh, that's super cute. He's gonna go ahead and talk to him as well. Oh, maybe our last child, because I only think we're gonna have like three kids, will be a girl. That'd be awesome. So cute. Okay, so we're going to have Drake go ahead and uh, go to sleep because he does have school in the morning. So, yeah, we're also going to go to sleep and we are feeling pretty happy about a new baby. That is so freaking exciting. We have little Josh. Little Josh Posh. 
Josh is posh. All right, guys. So I think I'm going to go ahead and end this part here. In the next part, we will probably have somewhat of a new remodeled home. We will most likely get a promotion to a level six astronaut. Uh, what does Candace need for her? Have five friends. We need one more friend. So we're going to work on it. We're going to work on it. And Drake should also get his grade up in school. So yeah, tomorrow or whenever the next part is, I don't know. Um, we should do pretty good promotion wise school wise and i guess house wise and we'll have a new baby so yeah i will see you all next time bye guys